Good day YouTube. On the topic of assisted death and dying. There are times when pain relief fails. Back in the dim distant past in my nursing days I remember two little old ladies dying of gangrene of the leg. One that was a legal technical failure of society. She was demented, she was schizophrenic, she'd come from the home for the bewildered with a black foot and her brother was a priest, her sister was a nun and they would not sign a consent form to condemn her to more years in the home for the bewildered. So she died of gangrene, an excruciating painful death. No amount of pain relief could cut through it. Similar story, little old lady, demented, gangrene, but with a heart condition, so she couldn't cope with the anaesthetic. And again, she had to scream herself to death. Takes over a week. I think for situations like that, family, doctors, nurses should be able to discuss the manoeuvre and administer a lethal injection. I think it's like back in the days when abortion was against the law. People were still acquiring abortions. 25% of the women were dying. People were suffering because there was no regulation. And medical staff wanted to do a decent job of it. So they changed the law. Well, also, I think with this assisted dying, the law should be changed. For the people who have no viable treatment options, who want to end their life cleanly, they should be allowed to. Warbles on a lot to YouTube. Ciao.